Hey, what's up everybody? This is Alex from Not Casuals, and today we're going to be playing Jamestown, The Legend of the Lost Colony. Uh, this will be a small tutorial of the four ships in this game. By the way, there are five difficulties in this game. Uh, the last one you need to complete all the stage at Divine to unlock, which I have not yet done. I'm missing one stage. And um, yeah, for this tutorial, we're just going to set it to um, difficult, I guess, just so uh, we don't get destroyed too fast. <laughs> So there are four ships in this game, uh, the beam, the gunner, the charge, and the bomber. Uh, we are going to try them all in the uh, this tutorial and try to uh, show you the flaws and the, the strong points of all of these uh, ships. Alright, so uh, first thing we need to know is that there are different types of uh, fire buttons. Left mouse button is uh, the normal fire attack. The right mouse button is the special attack. and um, uh, when you pr press uh, middle mouse, it's uh, your vaunt, which is basically uh, you can block some bullets for a few seconds, and uh, while your vaunt is active, you can do double points. And when you release your vaunt, uh, you're gonna be uh, you're gonna be blocking a small uh, radius of bullets as well. All right, so the beam main fire attack is a very spread attack, but rather weak, but um, rather useful as also. Uh, to take out the massive amounts of small targets like these. Uh, the good thing about this ship is that its alternate fire, the special attack, is uh, very potent against uh, stronger enemies. It's gonna destroy them very fast, so uh, it's a good balance ship. Um, sometimes a bit weak, in my opinion, but um, overall it's pretty good. Also, you can use the Vaunt, like any ships, uh, to block some targets, uh, some bullets. I mean, it's uh, extremely useful. And one year, like you can block, do it again, at the, but it's gonna cancel your your bonus though if you use it again to block a smaller radius of bullets. All the ships can do this. The Vaunt uh, special block ability, but uh, you need to collect the gold coins and see at the top right of the. Ooh, I almost got killed there. At the top left of the screen, there's a gold meter. Which is um, is your vaunt uh, ability. When this bar is full, you can use it, and when you trigger it, it starts to slowly drain, and then uh, you can cancel it by releasing. Although while you are in this ability, you get double the points, so it's useful. So yeah, I recommend uh, the charge for any new players. Uh, it's easy to master, and um, it's fun. It's useful. Alright, the second ship in this tutorial is will be the Gunner. Uh, his main ability is to simply fire both his special and his normal attack. But when you decide to use uh, the special attack, it's gonna you, you choose where it goes. So personally, this ship it can be tricky to master. Uh, aiming where you want with your special sometimes can be tricky because. Um, it's, you only use the the mouse configuration cannot be re rebind, and um, it's basically you try to aim where you need to aim. So you can play this game with only your mouse, only your keyboard or a controller if you want. Uh, this is one of my favorite ships, honestly. I'm pretty sure once people master this uh, ability, it's going to be extremely useful and potent. Uh, it does a lot of damage as well, so. Uh, but it requires a bit more practice, I'm not gonna lie. Of course, if you want, if you're you just want to use the ship and you're not very used to the special attack, you can just don't use the, the alternate fire and just left click left, left mouse button and it's gonna fire ahead of you, you know? And uh, it's still very powerful, it's just not uh, at full potential. Because you're supposed to use the ship to be able to aim on the side and stuff. Alright, we're now going to be using the charge. It's probably my favorite ship so far in the game. Uh, it's pretty easy to use as well. Uh, his main fire attack is kind of weak, but still going to destroy the weak, very weak units. Uh, his um, special attack is a ball of power that he focuses on some kind of beam, if you want. That he focuses in front of his ship, and uh, the longer you wait before shooting it, the stronger it's going to be. Um, if you don't want to wait, you can always spam it and uh, shoot smaller balls. 
uh, although the true power of this ability is to shoot and just dodge the bullets so this is extremely useful against bosses um, yeah I mean um, it's fairly easy to use compared to some other ships especially the last ship that we will introduce very shortly and um, yeah I mean, it's a cool ship too I mean full attack I like it easy to master all right uh, the last ship is the bomber it's a ship that is a normal fire attack is simply small bullets but you can choose to detonate them uh, by right clicking your mouse button uh, this is pretty useful against um, hordes of uh, small robots like these but uh, against a boss I personally don't like the ship um, I'm pretty sure some players will uh, master this ship and be really good with him with it but uh, I don't think it's gonna be one of my ships that I'll be using very often um, I don't know it's it's tricky to use it's pretty situational Almost died. It just doesn't have the firepower it needs to have, I think. But like I said, I'm pretty sure several players will love this ship. I don't. I just don't think it's my type of ship. That's all. All right. Thanks for watching, guys. This was Alex from Nut Casuals, and if you liked the video, make sure to leave a comment and subscribe. Thank you.